The government is set to provide farmers with hybrid maize seeds next year in a bid to boost production. This follows the conclusion of a seven-year research by the Kenya Agriculture and Livestock Research Organization, CARO, that guarantees the high-quality seeds. Dennis Sotino tells us more on this week's Smart Farm. Smart Farm, brought to you by Equity. Looking for a convenient way of receiving payments for your farming business? Get one equity till number for free. No sign-up fee, no commissions charged. Visit any equity branch or call 763 000 to sign up for free. Grow your farming business with one equity till number. At this research site by Calro in Kitale, Transzoia County, a revolution in maize farming is slowly taking shape. After seven years of research, Calro has developed a new technology that guarantees high-quality hybrid seeds for farmers. Uh, one of the challenges uh, farmers face is accessing affordable quality seed because the cost of production, the cost of breeding is very expensive. Dubbed Seed Production Technology for Africa, SPTA, the technology eliminates the need for detasseling, the process of removing tassels from the top of the maize plant in order to deter self-pollination that may lead to inbreeding. It is a normal breeding, like you take parent one and you cross with a parent two. Normally with the technology we take uh, the first one that doesn't produce uh, the pollen grains and we across it to a second one that is a pollen producer. Then we get a single cross or the F1 generation. Then we move again to form a hybrid, a three-way. So we take uh, the single cross and we, and we actually cross it to a third parent that is also a pollen producer. And then we get a three-way cross. Or a hybrid. The technology uses a naturally occurring maize gene called MS44 in the hybrid maize seed production. Seed companies globally prioritize traits that increase yields and improve tolerance to climate and weather risks through maize breeding and hybrid seed production. According to the researchers, the technology is expected to cut the cost by 40% and reduce cost of production for seed producers by 40,000 shillings, which they normally incur in detasseling. Whether it's an acre or 100 acres, in a row of five, you detassel four to be able to get a hybrid seed. That's the seed we call hybrid. That detasseling is very labor intensive. It is very expensive. The cost of detasseling is going to go down because the maize itself that we are targeting is that we are, we are targeting on, uh, on the production of the parents that are not supposed to produce the pollen grains on the tassel. Is that the cost of production of seed is also going to be reduced. Why? It is because the cost of labor in terms of employing people to detassel is also going to be reduced. Currently, seed producers and companies in Africa, including Kenya, prevent self fertilization by manual detasseling, a time sensitive process which involves removing the pollen producing tassels from the seed bearing maize plants. Denis Otieno, Smart Farm. Smart Farm, brought to you by Equity. Receive payments for your farming business conveniently through the One Equity Till number. Get one for free today at any equity branch or call 763 000. No sign up fee, no commissions charged. And the laser your Kilimo Biashara with One Equity Till number.